Hey, what's up? Scrag. Not in a car today. Not on my bike right now. I'm actually on my lunch break. I'm on my way taking back something that I bought at Walmart. Luckily for me, Walmart's only about a mile away, so I'm just walking, getting some steps in. But the reason I have this is because over this past weekend, I was doing a little reading and a little research and things like that, and I'm always looking to improve my health. And Durian Rider, a YouTuber, uh, big guy on cycling, but also a big activist as far as the vegan lifestyle, vegan movement, um, he's finally kind of gotten through to me on the idea of eating vegan, carving up. And if you've watched my recent videos, you've seen I've been at Costco a lot. And I started kind of, I don't know, just mentally in my mind going over the idea of eating a hot dog every day at Costco and all the Costco samples. And and I, I have to admit, hot dogs aren't healthy. While the calories, you know, are something that I can count, they just aren't a good source of energy you know you got lots of fat and just just unhealthy um, calories in a hot dog so I made the decision this weekend to try and eat a vegan diet and one of the first things I did was I went out last night I bought a rice cooker so that I could make my own rice at work while uh, while trying to live this this diet plan and so I went to use it today and sure enough open up the box and uh, the metal cooking portion is bent I was still able to make my meal however I'm not gonna deal with the issues that it's having where it's you know spraying uh, starchy water everywhere because the the lid doesn't seal properly anyway so that's what I'm up to right now. Figured I'd shoot this video and I'm just gonna upload it straight to YouTube. I'm not gonna do any tags or anything like that. I'm not sure what I'll title it, probably. My walking trip to Walmart, I don't know. Anyway guys, I'm gonna keep you, uh, keep you all informed as I head down this vegan path and see what it does for me. My current weight right now, uh, this morning when I got on the scale, was 174 pounds. So, hopefully, I'll be able to use this as a baseline. Now, I know in uh, Durian's uh, uh, teachings, he talks about something called metabolic damage. I'm not really a subscriber to the idea of metabolic damage, but we'll see. If I start putting on a ton of pounds, then you know, maybe, maybe there is something true to it. Um, I'm still gonna calorie count. I know that's one of the plans that they, or not one of the plans, but one of the uh, attributes of the raw till four diet is you don't have to calorie count. But I'm not really doing the raw till four thing. I'm actually doing more of a starch-based diet called the starch solution, starch solution, uh, by Dr. McDougall. Um, look him up. He's got some interesting points. And it fits more along the lines of what I can actually do as far as my food. Uh, living here in Utah, the fruit selection's not that great. I mean, we do have fruits, but they're usually pretty poor quality. However, I can get rice and beans and all these other things very easily. So that's, that's gonna be my direction. I'm not gonna do the raw till four. I'm gonna eat Plenty of fruit, plenty of vegetables, all that stuff. Um, and I'll try to uh, also incorporate it, incorporate it into my family's eating. So it's not just me this time. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be something that I do for my entire family. Uh, my wife and kids just got back from not really a vacation, but they were in California visiting for a, uh, a funeral. And after my wife got back, she just is, she's having all kinds of stomach, I don't know, digestive issues. And I think a large part of it is the diet that we eat. Um, 
her diet is different than mine. Uh, she eats a lot more meat than I eat. And, you know, it is what it is. So I'm being the, the primary cook in the household. I've always kind of made meals that fit what my family enjoys. And I work my way through it to make it my own. I think what I'm going to do now is do the meal more to what I would eat and they just are going to have to learn to eat it. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here, guys. I'm almost to, uh, to Walmart. And yeah, so let me know how you, uh, how you like this video. Maybe I'll do more of these daily walks because as I'm going to be eating at work from now on, I'm going to have more time to do these kind of videos. Anyway, take it easy, guys. And I'll see you later.